All right, Colin, say hi. Hello. All right, today we are making black bean burgers for on meatless. On some Mondays. On some Mondays. It's supposed to be meatless Mondays. Yeah, but we're not going to have it on every Monday. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is to saute garlic and onions. Colin, you want to come here and do it? We're going to stand over here. Why don't we have this book right here so we can video us, so we can show us? Well, we'll do that in a minute. So we're going to like cut up half an onion and four cloves of garlic to saute it. Is this like a how-to video? Maybe. So Colin's going to be over here sauteing for me. Do you like the smell of garlic and onions I mean, uh, being fried? And I have taken two cans of black beans and I've drained it, rinsed it and drained it and I baked it. And I baked it for 15 minutes at 325 degrees in the oven to dry it out. Let's see how Colin is doing sauteing those garlic and onions. How's it smell? It's not strong yet. Okay. All right. So this recipe was adapted from Sally's Baking Addiction, and I love using her recipes. She always has some great recipes to try, and Colin loves cooking with me. So we started by sauteing half um, a large onion and three garlic cloves. And after those were done being sauteed, we patted them dry and we added the following ingredients to the food processor. So I used a half a cup of oat flour, but you can also use breadcrumbs. I also used um, one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil, one and a half teaspoons of ground cumin, one teaspoon of chili powder, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, a fourth a teaspoon of smoked paprika, half a cup of feta cheese, two large eggs, one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, and two tablespoons of ketchup, but you can also use mayo or barbecue sauce, and some salt and pepper. Um, the recipe also calls for three-fourths cup of chopped bell pepper, but I don't like bell pepper, so I omitted that from the recipe. And here Colin is blending it up. He doesn't like the sound of a blender, so he's trying to cover his ears so that he can blend it up. And I added the two cans of black beans that I had drained, rinsed, and put it in the oven to dry it up. So we are making the patties right now, and I was really worried about the patties because they seemed a little bit dry. But actually, once we put them in the oven, they um, became less dry, so that was fine. Um, I don't know if adding the bell peppers would have added or reduced that moisture or not. Um, but either which way, this was a fun little project to try with Colin. And um, he's a great little helper, although he doesn't like his hands being dirty. Um, so with this, we were able to make seven patties. I think we could have made them a little bit bigger, so we possibly could have done about six of them. And we put them in the oven at 375 degrees for 10 minutes on each side.